Please don't skip ads. Proceeds go to the School Green Minded Project, where we teach everyone on gardening and sustainable agriculture. Hello there, what's up you guys? Welcome back to this another video edition of the Green Minded Project. And in this video, tuturuan ko po kayo kung paano po gawin itong ating organic fertilizer and pesticide gamit yung ating aloe vera. Yes, that's right. Hindi lamang po maganda yung aloe vera sa inyong skin, sa inyong buhok, but also they are very healthy for your plants. Kahit anong halaman, pwede po natin gamitin bilang pampataba at bilang pang puksa ng at pampataboy ng ating mga you know, insects and pests. So, what are you waiting for? Welcome to the Green Minded Project. Let's do it. Green-minded people, very simple. You just have to have this uh, chopping board. And syempre, dapat meron kayong kutsilyo at yung inyong mga aloe vera na gagamitin, okay? Napaka-simple lamang po na ating gagawin today, okay? Hindi po siya, wala pong halong kung ano-ano, but very simple. What you're gonna do is, because we will be needing all of them, like the entire uh, aloe vera. So, ang gagawin ninyo is itchachop lamang yan into small pieces like cubes. Ganun lang kasimple. There you go. Tapos, ichachap natin ito ng maliliit. Cube. There you go. Para lang kayong nagsaslice ng gulay, di ba? So, it's very important that we will be uh, cubing them para madali siyang uh, ma-absorb ng tubig mamaya kasi gagamitan natin siya ng tubig. There you go. So this is our cubed aloe vera. Pagkatapos naman ay kukuha tayo ng empty bottle ngayon. There you go. Kahit anong bottle yan. Tapos ilalagay natin to sa loob yung mga aloe vera. Diba? Napakadali. Very easy. This is the easiest thing that you can do at home. Pwede rin, pwede rin po kayong uh, gumawa nito kasama yung mga kids. And also, you may not use gloves kasi nga maganda itong aloe vera sa inyong skin. It's okay. So here you go, green-minded people. We have made uh, three bottles. So, nakagawa po tayo ng tatlong uh, bote ngayon na nilagyan po natin ng mga aloe vera, aloe vera cubes sa loob. There you go. Ayan. Okay. So, at this point, we are using actually 1.5 recyclable water bottles. And then, the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna pour water inside. Anything po na tubig ang pwede niyong iilagay dito. Uh, but this time, I'm gonna use tap water. So, galing sa gripo lamang po yung gagamitin natin na tubig at uh, pupuniin natin ito ng tubig. Ayan, green-minded people, we have already made three plastic bottles and uh, we're gonna call this uh, aloe vera mixture. So, hindi ko na po siya pinuno kasi nga para may space sa pag-shake natin mamaya. Ang gagawin natin next is, uh, isa-shake lang natin to. We're just gonna shake it. Ayan, so isa-shake lang po ninyo ng maigi. 
yung yung uh, aloe vera mixture. Ayan, at meron na tayong bagong gawang aloe vera mixture na gagamitin natin pesticide at the same time fertilizer as well. Ayan. So kung nakikita po ninyo, medyo clear pa yung water natin because what we're gonna do next is we're gonna let this stay here for 24 hours. So bukas pa po natin ito magagamit. And uh, bukas na bukas rin po or after 24 hours, pwede na po natin itong spray sa ating mga pananim. Uh, lumipas na po yung 24 hours. So what I did was, we already transferred this mixture dito sa ating bagong bote because we will be spraying this now to our plants. So, meron kaming uh, handy sprayer here. And uh, all you have to do is to insert this hose into the bottle and then ititwist lamang ninyo like that. And after that, you can use this as a uh, regular sprayer like this. So, ganun lang kasimple. Ayan. So, ilalagay natin siya sa mga leaves. Okay, so yung aloe vera natin, yung aloe vera actually contains salicylic acid. And ang salicylic acid ay talaga nagtitrigger siya sa immune system ng ating mga tanim to fight their own diseases, to fight the insects as well. At saka meron siyang content na nagtataboy sa mga insects, di ba? Yung kalaban natin, especially if we are doing organic. So I also advise you guys to to spray this uh in the morning or in the afternoon, hindi sa oras na to. Well, we're just doing this for uh, demonstration purposes. Okay? So, wala pong limit. Pwede kayo mag-spray ng uh, kahit ilan gusto nyo because it's organic. Bago po pala ako magpaalam, nais ko lamang po i-promote ang ating mga green-minded projects merchandise. Meron po tayong Tumblr na 300ml. And of course, uh, meron din po tayong tumbler na nasa 250ml. So, maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat ng tumulong sa amin sa Green Minded Projects. Especially kay Ma'am Nengche Paez. Thank you so much for uh, purchasing and also for uh, Ma'am Loredita Ibalig. Maraming maraming salamat po. Available na po yung ating merchandise. Sa bawat bili po ninyong ito ay makakatulong po kayo sa ating mga Green Minded Projects sa mga paalalan kung saan nagtuturo po tayo ng kahalagahan ng gardening and of course ng sustainable agriculture. Green Minded People, maraming maraming salamat po sa pag-view ng video ng ito. And uh, this is uh, the result of our uh, soaking. You're soaking this aloe vera for 24 hours. So, pag, pwede nyo pong i-stay ito ng until 3 days bago nyo gamitin because uh, they can be more effective according to research if they will be soaked for 3 days. If you have a lot of questions or any questions or concerns or suggestions in mind, please don't forget to comment that down below. And if you want to purchase our mugs, our tumblers, please do comment below as well. And as always, thank you so much for watching. This is The Green Minded Project. Goodbye!